you know what? I want to take that cowboy hat off his head and give him a little finger necklace right now. Look at this guy. This guy also ran a daycare babysitting service. His name is Tad Jeremy Cosden. He is now 42, and we think this goes way, way back. This is another scary part. Uh, not only is he running a daycare babysitting service, all right, but a case went to a grand jury just a couple of years ago. He started dating one of his maids, is the way I understand it. She goes downstairs to clean. He always encouraged her to bring her five-year-old little girl over when she would come and clean house. Something told Mommy to go upstairs. Mommy goes upstairs, and according to her, she sees this man on top of her five-year-old little girl. Okay? She sees the little legs, the five-year-old girl's legs poking out on either side. This goes to a grand jury. What happened to that, Alexis Weed? What happened to that? Nancy, the grand jury decided not to indict this guy. These charges were dropped. However, police are telling me that this woman, this mother of the five-year-old child, she's willing to cooperate as much as needed for this current investigation. Okay, I, I, I feel like I'm going to vomit right now. I, I'm just, I'm sick. This guy, we know of at least 50. Dean child victims. I'm hearing in my ear right now. I'm being joined out of Pearl Land, Texas. Special guest, Lieutenant Onesimo Lopez. Lieutenant Lopez, thank you for being with us. Thank you, Nancy. I'm putting this guy's picture up, Lieutenant, because I want every mother and father out there to see him. If they know him, if their child has ever gone to his babysitting or daycare service, they're on alert. Is it true, Lieutenant Lopez, you've seen the videos that the children looked like they were either asleep or drugged while he raped them? Uh, and that's correct. And we definitely want to get his image out there. We want anybody involved that, that may have been involved with that babysitting service to please come, in, come forward to contact us um, so we can work on identifying the, all the kids involved. Up to this point in the investigation, we've oh. identified one child, and we're, we're looking for uh, for for more uh, parents to come forward and, and so we can identify those other kids. Lieutenant, do you have any idea, and I'm not asking you who, do you have any idea who was behind the camera? Who was, what sicko would hold the camera while this 42-year-old man rapes children dressed in Disney PJs? What freak would do that? At this point, we don't know. That we're, we're still working that part of the investigation to try and identify everybody that was involved with the production of these videos because we want to hold them all accountable for, these, for, these, for this heinous act. Thank God you're on the case. And I tell you what, that Julia Lack, the 26-year-old girl, what she knows, she better start talking. That's all I can tell you. There, she, there you are, Miss Playboy Bunny on the Playboy website. Mm-hmm.